Compadre, I like meatloaf. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go crazy if Dad doesn't stop with the meatloaf. Hmm. If Dad won't stop with the loaf, then we'll all have to stop him. And I know how. Explain to me how blasting your dad with a freeze ray is gonna solve your problem. I'm not gonna freeze Dad. I'm gonna freeze his meatloaf. It'll take days to thaw out. And in the meantime, we can slip down some spaghetti, dog. <laughs> Bingo! Johnny's ready for some uh, spaghetti! Test family, it's dinner time! Kids, I have some bad news. There's been a terrible accident and there's no dinner tonight! Oh no! What happened? <laughs> We're gonna have to skip right through to dessert! This worked better than I planned. Oh, is it ice cream? Chocolate cake, chocolate cake and ice cream? Close! We're having meatloaf sickles! Start licking, kids! <laughs> I don't know. Frozen meat on a stick is a pretty good idea. Refreshing and filling. What's not to like? There's got to be some way to get him to give up meatloaf. But he's had so many good times with meatloaf. That's why he loves it so much. Hmm. So if I make him have a bad time with meatloaf, he won't love it anymore, and he'll never make it again. Well, sure, that's negative association. <laughs> so, what's a bad thing that can happen to my dad that has to do with meatloaf? Hmm. Uh -huh. Ooh, Dookie, you're a genius. Hope you guys are hungry. We sure are. <gasps> Whoa, that sure was a negative meatloaf experience, Dad. I bet you'll never want to see meatloaf again, huh? Who wants spaghetti? Johnny, did you have something to do with this? Johnny? Yes. <laughs> I can't believe you did that. You remember that today is National Prank Your Loaf Day. Prank your what? Me? <laughs> I've never been more proud of you, son. Oh, you sure got us good. But don't worry. I made a spare. <laughs> Meatloaf, meatloaf, meatloaf! Johnny, bring it out! Hey, nice job blowing up the meatloaf. You were attempting behavioral modification through Pavlovian conditioning? Johnny made meatloaf go boom. Sure, same thing. But it didn't work. I just want spaghetti. It was a good idea. I think we just need to try something bigger. 
What is it? Do you really want to know? Because it involves very complicated terminology. Or should I just say science-y stuff? Science-y stuff works. All you have to do is sprinkle a little bit on Dad's meatloaf. And then what happens? Let's just say we're going to be having spaghetti tonight. Oh, this new meatloaf recipe should surprise everyone. Okay, loaf, time to get cooking. Ah, who could that be? Huh, nobody there. Very strange. Ooh, I can smell it already. <laughs> what the? This doesn't look like the picture in the cookbook. <laughs> I'll never make me love again. <laughs> it worked. Spaghetti for everybody. You made a spaghetti gun? I love my sisters. Thanks. Okay, Meatloaf, your work here is done. <laughs> to have spaghetti. <laughs> Would you excuse me for one moment? Um, apparently his work here isn't done. <laughs> so, girls, when does the get rid of the scary meatloaf monster part of your plan kick in? Yeah, um, we may not have thought this one through. I know what to do. Johnny, what are you doing? Like most of life's problems, this one can be solved with spaghetti. Okay, spaghettis, it's time for a food fight. Go get that meatloaf! Stop making food monsters! Hey, you're supposed to be on our side. They look kinda angry. Yeah, we should run now. <laughs> so, instead of just eating your dad's meatloaf, you'd rather create giant food monsters that want to eat you. I don't think you understand how much I hate dad's meatloaf. Hello? Meatloaf? Mr. Monster? <laughs> we have to figure out a way to stop them! Think! What's the best way to fight back against food? Supercharged, ultra-powered kitchen utensils? Come on, Johnny, this is serious. Actually, we might have something there. Johnny! Ah. Susan! Ah. Mary! Ah. Duke! <laughs> what? I'm sticking with what I know. <laughs> Spaghetti! <laughs> oh, I like this fight. <laughs> gotcha, pasta. Awesome! Hey, are you gonna finish that? Time to deal with the meatloaf. And you know how much I like meatloaf. All right, meatloaf, we're serving you a plate full of trouble. We just checked your expiration date, and your time is up. Heat up the oven to 350 degrees of taking you down. Hey, nobody said anything about using action movie type lines that are food related. I'm not ready. <laughs> Oh, look, he has a friend. Well, this isn't good. He's got my whole family. Hold it right there! If you think for one second that I'm gonna stand by and let you eat my family, you better think again! I beg your pardon? There is no excuse for this behavior! Really? Just remember who carefully mixed you, put you in a pan, and popped you into the oven, mister! I brought 
you into this world. And believe me, I'll take you out. Do you understand? Uh -huh. <laughs> A little help here, Dad. All right, Meatloaf, go help my family. Give you meatloaf, and we're sorry we tried to replace you with spaghetti. Uh, meatloaf, where are you going? Wherever food is out of hand, I'll be there. Goodbye, test family. Wow, not only did Dad's meatloaf save the day, he's like a superfood. And you didn't believe me when I said meatloaf is good for you. <sighs> oh, you would not believe the day I had at work today. I'm starving. What's for dinner? We're eating out! Rocket boots, laser belt, atomic comb. Oh. I'm probably gonna regret asking, but why are you naming and throwing inventions over your shoulder? Because it's Easter, and I need something awesome to win the annual Easter egg hunt. Ah, uh, the egg hunt. That magical candy tradition where your sisters beat the pants off you every year. And the winner of the Easter egg hunt is Susan and Mary Tess. <laughs> <laughs> I cheated. Turning me into an egg-laying chocolate chicken is not exactly in the rules. Perhaps not, but your eggs were delicious. <laughs> we agreed to never <laughs> speak of that again. Besides, this year, I'm totally gonna win. <laughs> <laughs> no way, little brother. Oh, yes way. Cause this year, I'm not gonna be your egg-laying guinea pig chicken thing. Don't need you to. We've got Easter inventions covered. Behold! The Turbo Easter Egg Imager with satellite tracking to pinpoint all egg locations. And our new 4D vision goggles. Complete with x-ray, infrared, and laser precision vision. Everything needed to spot Easter eggs. But don't feel bad, Johnny. There's a scientific reason we always win. Yeah, we're awesome. Yeah! Uh -huh. We're geniuses. Yeah. Boy. Then I challenge you to a test family egg collection contest. Go on. Whoever collects the most eggs and wins a contest gets the other test kids candy. You're on. Hope you enjoy losing candy, Johnny. Woohoo! They're right, Johnny. Those inventions look particularly sciency. Oh yeah, well so does this awesome rotten ray. Yeah, with this baby, I'm totally gonna win. No running. Only one basket per kid. That's not chocolate! Hmm. Hmm. Whoa, son! No weapons or rays allowed in the Easter egg hunt. What? But Susan and Mary get to use their stuff. <laughs> I'm sure whatever they have is harmless. Besides, Easter is about hugs, love, and candy. Not rays, weapons, and destruction. Sorry, Johnny. Without your sister's inventions, I don't see how you're gonna win. Don't worry. I have a backup secret weapon. My egg-sniffing best pal. Hey, I thought I was your best pal. Uh, dude, you are? And I need that super sniffer of yours. Nah, I'll pass. I'll split the candy with you. Ooh, oh, I'm in. Let the Easter egg hunt begin! Johnny Tess, prepare to be destroyed. Oh, great. Not today. I have been waiting for this day for... No, oh, no, you don't, Mr. Dark Vegan. This is Easter, and Easter is a fun, happy time for kids only. <laughs> but this is Destroy Your Nemesis Month. See? I'm sorry. You'll just have to try to destroy my son another day. Shoo, shoo, go on, go on. Out, 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 out. That was sweet, Dad. You're like a fluffy, fuzzy bunny superhero. It's all part of being an official Easter bunny. Now, let the Easter hunt begin. <laughs> I think I've got something. Go, Dookie, go! 
Mmm, bacon breakfast burrito. <laughs> Would you focus? Susan and Mary are beating us. Right. Found one. Nice work. Nothing's gonna stop us from beating Susan and Mary. No, nothing is gonna stop you except me, Johnny Test. I'll play your little Easter games if that's what it takes to destroy you once and for all. <laughs> Ooh, an egg. Signal seems weak. Better activate satellite laser positioning. Lasers for what a It's still not working right. We did connect it to the right satellite, didn't we? Oh, there we go. Ah, here it is. Another championship. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That's one weird looking kid. <laughs> I have you now. <laughs> oh, sorry, kid. Wait. Mustache? Let me switch my gamma setting. <laughs> I'm horribly allergic to gamma radiation. Painful, bitchy, vibes! Yeah, uh, hold on. I have a soothing white light right here. Oh, I can't see. <laughs> no rocket blasting. Curse that meddlesome bunny. Mm. Uh -oh. What did I just say about rockets? That's it. You're coming with me. Is it me, or are the kids in this neighborhood getting uglier? You are in a timeout, little boy, until you realize that Easter is about hugs, love, and candy. Attention, egg hunters! The hunting is over, so please report to the table for final count. No, uh, hmm? oh, it's over, all right. Over for Johnny Test! <laughs> Way. You're going down, and I'll be eating all of your sweet candy. So you like the taste of candy eggs, eh, Johnny? Mm -hmm. Well, let's see how you like the smell of rotten ones. Hey! That ugly kid's got my rotten ray. Oh, I'm no ugly kid. It is I, the handsome dark vegan, come to ruin your Easter. Dude, seriously? Ha <laughs> ha! Smell my vengeance! I just smell candy. Huh, guess the ray didn't work. Oh, it works! It just doesn't turn things into the kind of rotten you're thinking. Now might be a good time to leave. Oh, rotten as in mean little sucker. Didn't see that coming. This is better than I imagined. Go, my egg army, and destroy Johnny Test! <laughs> no, wait! I am your leader! <laughs> Stop those eggs before they destroy all the candy. And pork belly. One thing at a time. Let's roll. Hey, grab them. Come here. Gotcha. Oh, go biting. Ow. Man, those eggs are vicious. So much for Dad saying Easter was all about hugs, love, and candy. And I guess we should kiss candy goodbye forever. <laughs> Bye, sweet friend. <laughs> hey, it's normal again. And delicious. Wait a minute. Dad might have been onto something with that lovey junk. The positive emotional reaction to the eggs must have overpowered the rotten ray's crabbing effects. That's how we can beat these rotten eggs. 
We have to love them back to normal. Yeah, can that not be it? Because guessing's not really my thing. Start loving! <laughs> 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 you guys are so sweet. Happy <laughs> stuff. That looks like the last of them. Well, except for those pummeling dark vegans. No. Ah, stop. Ooh, oh, no, stop that. No. I gave you life. Ooh. Johnny just saved Dark Vegan. Who are you, and what have you done with our little brother? Well, you know what Dad says. Easter's about hugs, love, and candy. Wait, all the eggs went haywire before we could finish counting. So how do we know who won the contest? According to the Easter Bunny guidebook, if candy eggs sprout legs and behave badly, all contestants are declared winners. That's oddly specific. What does that mean? It means we all win and get to eat candy. You may be safe on Easter, Johnny. But tomorrow, I will destroy you! But first... Are there any more jelly beans? Yeah, there's more over there. Best Easter ever! <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.